Hi there everybody, this is Megaharve here playing Let's Play of Super Punch-Out for the Super Nintendo. Yes, I'm actually playing a good game this time around. It was mandated after I got out of the Insane Asylum, after playing those other two games, that I have to play a good one this time. Otherwise, I might just end up doing something that I'll regret. So without further ado, let's proceed on to this. I've played this game more times than I care to count. I am... Um, head age, come on. Yeah, I played this a lot as a child. I used to be able to beat everybody super fast, but I haven't really played this game too much recently, so I can't guarantee how good I'm going to do here. I'll just take it in stride, try to do this in one take. Hope for the best. So anyways, here's Gabby J. Let me win. I've lost so many times, I forgot how winning feels. Yes, he did win once. Lost 99 times. That one victory was a knockout victory against Glass Joe for anyone who's keeping score at home. Because Glass Joe so hard to beat. But I'm sure he was proud of it. Yeah, that's all you really gotta do. He's gonna swerve and, yeah, you hit people at the right time, hit them in the stomach like that, they go down one shot. I think every boxer in this game, if you do that at the right time, they're knocked down instantly. I'm not 100% sure. I can't believe, Black, like, Gabby J just hit me like that. That was bloody nonsensical. Or whatever. There's no proof that it happened, other than the video proof. I mean, anytime you see the face colored like that, it means do more energy. Do more energy, yeah. You attack faster, and you do more damage to your enemy. So yeah, you want to take advantage of that when you get it. I think it has something to do with super punch-out meter at the bottom. I'm really not 100% sure on that. I just know it happens from time to time. So. Yeah. Alright, perfect. Number one. Even though you can be beaten a lot faster. Whatever. And here's Bear Hugger. Watch out! I'm a killer! I'm the Bear Hugger! Yeah, I, I don't really know too many Canadians like this. This game might as well just be called Ethnic Stereotype Beatdown, because essentially that's what it is. And I don't know if I stole that from something or if I made it up myself. I'm really not sure. But yeah, Ethnic Stereotype Beatdown is pretty accurate. But yeah, it's a common misconception that you can't punch this guy in the stomach. You just have to wait until he's pointing. Like, that entire window where he's pointing, if you punch him in the stomach, it hurts him. So, but yeah, normally you have to go like that and punch him in the face. Punch him in the face. That's really all there is to him. Once you know enough to punch him in the stomach and the dodge is double clubbing strike that he does. Pretty much all gravy. Boom, boom, and good move. And that's that, folks. Probably not getting up. He'll shake his head, but won't get up. And a victory for me, a knockout victory. Under 30 seconds. I never have beaten him in under 17 seconds. Um, he says in the credits... Spoiler alert! He says in the credits that... People can be in 17 seconds. I'm pretty sure that it's possible. I've just never done it. So, yeah. Well, as long as I beat Derek, that's, that's kind of my main concern. So. Derek can cry himself to sleep that I beat his best score. Here's Piston Hurricane. Can you ride out the storm or be caught in my hurricane rush? I really don't know what a Cuban accent sounds like. I guess I should listen to Armando Alejandro Estrada for that kind of... Anyway. Piston Hurricane. I can beat this guy in six seconds. I don't know if I will in this run. I hope I will. But in all likelihood, I won't. But this is how you do it. You just punch him in the face like this. Until he backs off. Then punch him in the stomach at the right time. Okay, perfect. Yeah, and then just wait for him to get up. Seven, then just... Ah! Anyway, but yeah, how you're supposed to do it is as soon as he gets up, you hit the super punch button, super punch him in the stomach, and he's down in six seconds or so. What, what, like, like, that's more or less what you're supposed to do, except the first time. I still got him in 13 seconds, that's not bad. 
I can't believe I dropped the ball like that. Like, like I know anyone who watches this knows that it's capable of doing it. But it just, it just irritates me. On principle. Whatever. For all the difference it makes. Like, how could Mario only get 228? Like, you think he'd be a lot wrapped enough matches he'd be able to. Anyway. Here's Bald Bull. You'll be down for the count with one punch from my bull charge! Yeah, learning how to knock this guy down with the bull charge is pretty essential. I'm not entirely sure if you can beat him without doing that. So, so yeah. I'm probably not going to beat this guy super quick, but I will beat him. I hope, at least. Okay, he's going to do two of those, so I'll counter and punch him like that. Yeah, it takes a little while. To best of my knowledge, any of these fights, like they follow the same pattern each time, so as long as you... Why is my buttons not working? Alright, counter knock them down, how do you like that? But yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, like they have the same pattern every time, so you can figure them out. Here's the... There we go, yeah, this is what you want to do. Knock them down one shot. Otherwise, if he hits you, he knocks you down in one shot, so. But he's gonna start doing it again, hopefully. Okay, perfect. I guess I'm not as rusty as I thought. But yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna... I figure I might as well keep these videos separate, like, do a league per video. It'll just be... I don't want to stop and halfway through a video, it'll be easier to watch if I do it like this. So, yeah. I did reasonably well. I'm not trying to brag or anything like, like Mike Tyson's punch out or punch out as it's also called. I only own the punch out version. I don't have Mike Tyson's punch out. Like I have a much harder time with that one, and the uh, and the, the one that came out for the Wii is really good. Yeah, I played that one a lot. I'm not as good as him at this one. Well, good subjective. I like to think I'm all right. I don't really want to build myself up too good, then I get later and get squashed by somebody, so. Anyway, so yeah, we'll wait until the next uh, episode to get to the major circuit, so until then, I do thank everybody for watching, and I hope you all have a pleasant evening.